Another major development in the pandemic today. New recommendations from the nation's top health agency could once again be changing our way of life. The CDC now says people should put those masks back on while indoors, even if you're vaccinated. The new guidance applies now to 60% of U.S. counties, many of them highlighted there in red and orange across the South and the Southwest. The CDC also recommends masks for all teachers, staff, and students inside schools nationwide, regardless of your vaccination status. News Nation's Allison Harris is live in Washington, D.C. tonight with the very latest. Allison. Robin Marnie, we've been talking for weeks and months now about a return to pre pandemic life, but today it feels like the U.S. is taking a huge step backwards. The president, in a statement tonight, mentioning lockdowns and shutdowns. The president saying that more vaccinations and more mask wearing could prevent the U.S. from returning to those closures that we all lived through last year. The CDC is recommending people put on their masks indoors yet again, even if they're fully vaccinated in areas where there's low vaccination and high COVID spread. Those areas include areas shown in red, meaning much of the southeast and parts of the west. The CDC director saying that new scientific data shows even those who are fully vaccinated can carry and transmit the Delta variant called COVID on steroids. It's a major reversal for the Biden administration, which declared independence from COVID and a summer of freedom earlier this month. This was just two months ago. If you've been vaccinated, you don't have to wear your mask. I think it's a great milestone, a great day. Cut to today. When he made those comments back in May, uh, we were dealing with a very different strain of the virus. The president in a statement tonight mentioning lockdowns and shutdowns, saying more vaccinations and mask wearing in the areas most impacted by the Delta variant will enable us to avoid those closures as 51% of the country is not fully vaccinated. If you're not vaccinated, you're not nearly as smart as I thought you were. The CDC director saying this could have been avoided had more Americans gotten their shots. The CDC also recommending today that students at all grade levels from kindergarten through high school wear masks going back to school, even if they're over 16 and have been vaccinated. The governor of Nebraska firing back on Twitter, telling the CDC to get out of the way, saying students won't be required to wear masks or get vaccinated. Several states have already banned mask mandates, including Florida, Arkansas, Iowa, Montana, South Carolina, Tennessee, and Texas. There's now outrage and debate over masks once again from a Tennessee pastor vowing to oust members of his congregation if they wear masks. If they go through round two and you start showing up all these masks and all this nonsense, I'll ask you to leave. I will ask you to leave. To a let them breathe rally in California. Masking requirements, they're arbitrary. Health experts maintain that severe breakthrough cases for those who are fully vaccinated remain very rare. And there is some other breaking news out of the White House tonight. The president saying that vaccine mandates for more federal workers are now under consideration. Robin Marnie, 